Hey folks, today we're going to work on creating and editing a feature class. So we'll go to the analysis tab up top. We'll click on tools. Then in the geoprocessing search bar, we'll type in create feature class. Once the tool comes up, you can click on it. So we'll start by de determining where the feature class will be saved. Then we'll give the feature class a name. Below the name, we'll pick the feature class geometry type. So you can choose point, multi-point, polygon, polyline, or multi-patch. This is one of the places you can determine the geometry type of the feature class you want to create. For us, we'll just use point. Then we'll give the feature class a chord in the system. We'll use the current map option. After that, you can click run. After the tool is finished running, you'll see your feature class appear in the map. So now we want to edit this. So we'll go to the edit tab up top. Most of you will have the editing toggle not enabled, but if you have it enabled, you can click it and then click create features. If you don't have it enabled, you can go to straight to create features. So we'll click on a feature class we just made, then we'll select the point tool, and this will create new points for this feature class. So I'll just go around drawing points just for demonstration purposes. Once you're done with your edits, you can click edit again and then hit the save button. A dialog box will show up and ask you if you do want to save your edits. You can click yes if you do. If you don't want to see this anymore, you can click the don't show this message again box. You can also discard the edits and another dialog box similar to the save will pop up. Thank you. If you found this video helpful, please like, subscribe, hit the notification bell for more content.